to the 1996 Fashion Design Forecast, featuring the collections for fall of 1996 and 97. This year, we are dedicating our fashion show to the memory of Walter Gerson, who had a passion for fashion. He was instrumental in finding all the wonderful critics that we have had the privilege of having throughout the years. We will miss him tremendously. The graduating class of 1997 have been working very hard throughout the semester, putting together the collections that they were about to unveil for you this evening. They have been working under the supervision of the art and apparel instructors and under the close guidance of a renowned fashion designer from the industry. These critics have been most generous with their time, giving up precious time from the very busy schedule, coming into our classrooms and working with our students, allowing them to avail themselves of their expertise. We are most grateful for the generosity and we thank them deeply. The models in the show are the students from the Model Workshop Club. And now I would like to introduce you Alan Hirschfield, the president of FIT. Thank you, Professor Rosa. And welcome to FIT's fashion forecast for 1996. This is indeed an exhilarating time for all of us here at FIT. One of the great characteristics of this college, which distinguishes it from so many others, is that we don't have to wait 20 years to find out what our graduates can do. We see what they can do just before they graduate. And you are going to see a demonstration that I find remarkable. Every year, I ask the faculty in fashion and apparel design what they're going to do for an encore, and every year they do a better job. And we're extremely proud of what the faculty and students have accomplished this semester. I also want to take this opportunity to publicly thank the critics who gave so generously of their time. We can't thank them enough. They're very busy people, and their willingness to give of their time helps make these shows what they are. I also want to thank Professor Alex Bodea for his work in arranging the seating. And if you think that's an easy job, you have another thing coming. Thank you very much, Professor Bodea. Before I move on to presenting the Critics' Awards, I would like to make a special note about the man for whom, to whom tonight's show is dedicated, Walter Gerson. FIT's fashion forecast fall 1996 is, as Professor Rosa said, dedicated to the late Walter Gerson. Walter was employed at FIT for many years. He was responsible for special programs at the college, and was the individual who arranged for the industry critics for all of our fashion design classes. I did not know Walter well, but I do know he was a cultured man who loved music, his family, the fashion industry, and above all, FIT. He was really devoted to his work and made an extraordinary commitment to doing things right. Even during his very last days at work, when he knew his own days were numbered, he was diligent in completing all of his assignments and touching all of the necessary bases and leaving instructions for everyone before he left the campus. We are very grateful for the expertise and knowledge Walter Gerson shared with the college and its faculty and students. We were glad to know him. He is deeply missed by the FIT community. And now I would like to begin uh, announcing the winners. But before I do that, for each category, there is a theme for the category. And I think it will help you understand and appreciate what you see uh, a little more fully if you know what the theme is for each category. Now, not all of them have themes. But the first category is children's wear, scene one. And the theme for that scene is fantasy Olympic athletic wear. The uh, faculty 
are Joanne Manna, Barbara Seggio Apparel, uh, Karen Pritchett, Newman Art, and the critic, Michael Sui for Donna Karen. The winner is Kimberly Shear. Good evening, everyone. Um, first, I'd like to thank Chairman Rosa and Professor Mana for inviting me back again for a great um, critic session. Um, I had a great time. Um, I had 21 ambitious students, and they made me proud. And I'm really grateful to um, have that opportunity to work with them. But tonight, we're here to honor Kim Shear. And uh, what separated Kim was her not only professionalism and expertise in creating her own outfit, but also helping her other fellow students, giving her time and her energy. And I think that's what makes a winner. And tonight, I applaud you, and I wish you all the best. I would just like to thank my critic, Michael Sue and my teachers, Professor Manna, and Professor Seggio, and Professor Newman, and also my classmates for making this a wonderful experience. The next category is Sportswear 2, Scene 2, and the theme for this category is Futurism. The faculty are Jimmy Newcomer Apparel, Sandra Frank Art, and the critic is Mary Jane Marcasiano, and the winner is Jisoo Song. I'm very happy to be part of the show that's uh, dedicated to Walter Gerson, because as all of, you, all of you know, he was the man that no one could say no to, and um, we'll all miss him. And Jisoo. Um, she has a winning combination of both talent and skill, and I will take you to uh, very good places, and congratulations. I just want to thank you for my critic and all my professors, and I want to special thank for my parents and all my families and my friends. Thank you. The next category is Sportswear 3, Scene 3. And this is a particularly interesting category because the theme is Denim Plus. Every garment in this particular category is made of denim. And I think that you will be very much surprised by what you see. The faculty for this category are Linda Sands Apparel, Lorraine Scalamoni Art, and the critic is Van Lupu. The winner is Elizabeth Reynolds. Uh, thanks for inviting me back this year. And uh, before I honor my top student, I want to especially thank Professor Sands for her uh, unrelenting guidance to this class uh, from design inception to the finished product, which you're going to see now. It was a tough choice when you had a class bursting with talent, but uh, my winner, Elizabeth Reynolds. Um, what can I say? Thank you, Professor Sands, you were fabulous. And for Van Lupu, who made designing a total joy. And this is my dream here tonight, and thank you all. <laughs> Next category, current scene, scene four, and pay particular attention to the theme for this particular category because the assignment was to prepare a gown for a celebrity attending an award ceremony. Let your imagination run wild as you try to figure out who the gowns were designed for. The faculty members involved, Mark Sitkovic, apparel, Lorraine Scalamoni Art, and the critic, Susan Standen for Magasconi Incorporated.
The winner is Grace Chen. Um, thank you, FIT, for having me this year. Um, the reason that the project was set was so that people could be very individual in their designs and everybody could do what they were really into. And um, actually, nobody picked Madonna, which shocked me. I was very pleased about that. <laughs> um, but it, it was very tough to make a decision because there was a lot of talent in the class. And the reason that Grace was chosen, um, one of the main reasons was from the beginning of the project to the end of the project, she paced herself and, and did a fantastic job and she was as skillful as talented and the dress was beautiful and I really don't, still to this day, don't know how she pulled it off because it was a difficult dress. Anyway, thank you and good luck, Rose. First, I thank my critic of my this word. It's very great for me. And I thank um, Thank for Professor Sitkowik, Professor Scalamoni, and all the professors helping me, and all the friends and classmates helping me. It's very, very great for me. Um, I remember this evening forever. Thank you. I will give you a clue about that category because Ms. Shen told me that the gown that she designed was designed for Sharon Stone. So you can imagine that when you see the winning. Uh, we're now in the category of uh, Sportswear 1, Scene 5. The uh, theme is tailored sportswear for the modern woman. The faculty members are Wally Sloves Apparel, Linda Tane Art. The critic is Kenneth Richard, and I might add, that Kenneth is an FIT graduate, and we're very proud of that. The winner is Trina Ekman. I'm particularly proud to be here tonight um, because uh, Walter was, he was quite a man and quite a role model for me when I was a student here five years ago. Um, he sort of showed that you can still be polite, decent, courteous, maintain integrity and be charming, and still be in the fashion industry, which I gotta tell you is quite a, quite a, quite a challenging thing to do. I wanna thank the uh, professors that I worked with this season, Wallace Lowe's and Linda Tain, who also maintained all of the integrity and charm and were just quite a blast to work with as well as the 28 students in the class who really brought along a lot of um, ambition and drive and talent and dreams and hopes. And I've got a funny feeling we're going to be seeing a lot more of all of them in the future. And uh, we did have one student, however, and as it always is, who uh, rises to the occasion in just a special way with a magic charm that um, really pulls off and shows off at the last minute. And that student is Trina Ekman, I'm quite proud of her, and I hope to see a lot more. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm so honored to receive this award. I want to thank Kenneth on behalf of all of our, uh, the students in our class. He spent so much time working with us and teaching us all about the industry. And we really do appreciate it. Thank you. I'd also like to thank Professor Tane and Professor Sloves and the, uh, the rest of the professors that I've had throughout the, my semester here. Um, I'd also like to thank my husband Gary for putting up with all of the stress and, and late nights and, and everything. Thank you very much. <laughs> Next category is intimate apparel, scene six. Yes, I can even figure that one out. Uh, the theme, and which is a very interesting one, is haute couture at the Metropolitan Museum. And you'll see the inspiration there. The faculty are Colette Wong Apparel, Linda Tain Art. The critic, Andra Gabrielle. Andra is also an FIT graduate. 
And the winner is Jamie Wong. I wanted to thank um, Professor Wong and Professor Tang, who really helped me and taught me a great deal, as did the class. And Jamie's work is an inspiration to me, and I think that you'll understand why we selected her when you see her gone. Congratulations. I would like to thank Professor Wong and Professor Tang, my family, and most of all, my best friend and inspiration, my mom. The next category, Tailored Garments, Scene 7. There is no specific theme for this particular group, but I think you'll be very pleased with the elegance of the garments. The faculty are Gunter Rooker, Apparel, Ruth Rosenthal, Art. The critic is Stephen D. Geronimo. Stephen, too, is an FIT graduate. And the winner? is Marie Kalinowski. Uh, good evening. Um, this is my um, second year in a row back, and I'd like to say thank you very much. Um, I had a great time uh, both years in a row. Um, I chose Marie this evening because um, I watched her through the class, um, and she conducted herself in a very professional manner when um, uh, there were certain sections of the project that were due. Um, she was always ready and um, in a very professional uh, manner, and you could see her kind of developing her um, outfit like a professional fashion designer. And um, she also showed uh, very, very good uh, taste ahead of her age, I thought. Um, her garment looks very, very professional. Um, and also, after I chose her in my head, her professor Gunter told me that she was considering changing her career from fashion design, and I think that would be a huge mistake. I think she needs a boost of confidence because she's a very talented person. I would just like to thank the critic and my teachers, and um, my parents especially, and also my friends especially, to Bun and Lori. They've helped me a lot through it. I've been very stressed, and they definitely helped me get through, and they've put up with a lot. Thank you very much. And the final category, Design Studio 8. The theme is Design Cavalcade Five Decades. And if I may be permitted to comment here, while the entire show is dedicated to Walter Gerson, uh, and he would have loved the entire show. He would have been wild about the theme of this one, the design cavalcade, five decades. I hope you will be too. The faculty, Lita Conde, Apparel, Stephen Stippelman, Art, the critic, George Seaman. George, too, is an FIT graduate. And the winner, Dennis Beard, who I might also add, is a concert pianist. He is, in the words of the arts, a triple threat person. First, I want to thank Professor Condi and Professor Zippelman. And my best wishes and good luck and congratulations to you today. Thank you. I would like to. Thank all of my professors, especially my critic, Mr. Sayman, Professor Conte, Professor Stippelman, and my be two beautiful models. Thank you. That finishes the categories. Now it's a pleasure to say, on with the show.
Sportswear 2, Instructors Jimmy Newcomer Apparel, Sandra Frank Art, Critic Mary Jane Marcusiano. The Mary Jane Marcusiano Award winner is Jisoo Song.
current scene. Instructors, Marge Zakovic Apparel, Lorraine Scalamoni Art. Critic, Susan Standen, for Magashoni Inc. The Susan Standen Award winner is...
short couture designs used as inspiration for lingerie as illustrated by Stephen Stippelman. Instructors, Colette Wong Apparel, Linda Tain, Art, Critic, Andra Gabriel. The Andra Gabriel Award winner is Jamie Wong. And now, Couture de Nuit. Yeah. 
Garments, Instructors, Gunter Rooker Apparel, Ruth Rosenthal, Art, Critic, Stephen D. Geronimo. The Stephen D. Geronimo Award winner is Marie Kalinowski.
is shaping up with style from Video Fashion Monthly.